Hi, I'm Charles Didlisser, and I'm here with my work Anthropocene 2 at Number 20 Arts in Islington in this exhibition, Winter Green Boxwood, which is a group show of RCA graduates from the 2020 year um, who have all made work during lockdown. Some of this work is from lockdown, and some isn't. Uh, this is my latest piece, which came into this gallery almost uh, fresh out of the studio. Um, it's concerned with the idea of how the, um, the idea of the sublime and sublime landscape and how that's changed during the Anthropocene, during an epoch when human beings have had a greater impact on the environment and the world around us, how our understanding and our aesthetic interaction with landscape changes. This painting here behind me is Garden of Hubris 3, which is part of the Garden of Hubris series I've been making since, um, I think, 2018. Uh, and again, it's being exhibited here at number 20 Arts in Islington. So it's concerned with um, the ideas about nature that we hold to be sort of given absolute truths, like the idea of romanticism, the idea of the separation between humans and nature, and the sort of subject object relationship where you have a human subject and a natural object. And so these paintings were sort of an articulation of the eeriness and the inappropriateness of, um, uh, of this separation between human um, subject and natural object, especially increasingly today in the climate crisis of the Anthropocene. So I'm here with my third and final painting in this exhibition, um, Energy from the Sublime, which was a painting I did about two years ago or a year and a half ago. It's concerned with the um, our ability to experience uh, the sublime as in sort of the traditional sense of the divine of nature in a world where human beings and human ingenuity has a greater impact and a um, and sort of shields us from natural elements. Um, I was looking in the work at sort of creating a denuded sort of still scene in an otherwise quite hostile and um, foreboding landscape.